For a very long time, I have wanted to be able to do 100 push-ups at one shot. At one point in my life, I got to the point where I could do like 52, 53 push-ups. Then life got crazy. I stopped doing my daily push-ups and I couldn't actually get back to doing more push-ups. In 2015, I had this idea, hey, I'm going to do on the first day of the year, I'm going to do one push-up. Second day of the year, I'm going to do two push-ups. Third day of the year, I'm going to do three push-ups. Fourth day of the year, right, I'm going to do three sets of, th of each of those. And I'm going to get to 300 push-ups by the end of the year. That doesn't work. Uh, by the way, I don't know why exactly it doesn't work, but there's something in the body's mechanics that don't allow you. It's not allowing enough recovery time for your muscles to recover to actually get to where you can do 100 push-ups. As a human, though, I think I should be able to do 100 push-ups. I've done 50 push-ups before at one shot. I've done that three, four, five times a day at one point in my life. I should be able to do that. So I'm going to use a combination of things and I'm going to make ChatGPT a fitness expert and then I'm going to ask it to put together a plan for me to help me get to 100 push-ups. Today is September 12th. I would like to be able to do 100 push-ups by January 1st, 2025. So uh, you are a health and fitness expert specializing in helping people get to 100 push-ups at a single session of doing push-ups. You are going to help me put together a plan to get to 100 push-ups. Please confirm your understanding of this uh, context. Got it, I understand you're looking to blah, 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 and you do have, and do you have a specific timeline to reach your goal? So it's already asking me <laughs> what, today is September 12th, I would like to be able to do 100 push-ups at one time by January 1st. Is this possible? Realistic? Yes, it's definitely possible if you follow a consistent and progressive training plan. You have about 16 weeks, which is plenty of time to gradually build your strength and endurance. Phase one, building a foundation. Goal increase. So it's already putting together a, a plan for me. All right. So here's what it's putting together for me. It says goal increase push-up capacity. So so what it says is uh, for my workout, do three sets of push-ups every other day, resting one to two minutes between sets. Do three sets of push-ups resting one to two minutes between sets. Starts by doing 50 to 70% of your max push-ups per set. If you can do 20 push-ups, then start with 12 to 14. So right now I can do about 30 push-ups. So I think I will just start with 23 per set and then gradually increase the reps each week. Okay, that's it. Goal, increase push-up volume in weeks five to eight. Progressively overload your muscles by increasing reps and sets. Do four to five sets of push-ups three to four times a week. Okay, continue to increase the number of push-ups per set. By the end of this phase, you should aim to be doing 50 to 60 push-ups across multiple sets. Now that's interesting. So it thinks I can get there in weeks five to eight. So the, then we're in weeks nine to 12, build the capacity to hit higher reps in one go. Higher rep sets, reduced rest time. Begin by attempting to do larger sets, i.e. 30 to 40 reps with fewer sets and shorter rest. Use pyramid or ladder methods. Start at 10, increase by five each set, and then back down. So I'm going to have to ask it for more details on the latter method. I, I kind of know what that is, but I want to know specifically what that is. And then reach 100 push-ups in a single set. Max effort sets and refining endurance. Gradually try to increase the number of consecutive push-ups, aiming for 80 to 90 push-ups by week 15. Test for 100 push-ups by week 16. Throughout the plan, you'll also want to focus on rest and recovery, taking rest days to avoid overtraining. Supplement your push-ups with exercises like planks, shoulder presses, and nutrition and hydration. Great. Um, does this work for you or would you like to adjust any part of it? I have no idea if this is going to work for me or not. Can you be more specific about weeks one through four? Tell me what should be happening each week. All right, one of the things about ChatGPT that I found is it it's very good at like if you really refine in, I mean, it, it, it has all of the knowledge of combined humanity 
So if you don't get very specific about it, it's just gonna go very generic. As soon as you get more specific, it's going to give you more specific things. All right, so now in the building foundation, it's giving me weeks one through four. This is all I need for the next four weeks. So day one, do a max effort push-up test to see how many push-ups. So today is day one. I'm gonna do a max effort push-up test to see how many push-ups I can do in a single set. So I'll adjust the camera and we'll do that. And record this number, let's call this your baseline. And then the goal is you'll work at 50 to 70% of this baseline number for three sets, three days this week. I.e. if you did 10 push-ups, you'll aim to five to seven push-ups per set. Okay, so my schedule is Monday, Wednesday, Friday, I'm gonna do a warm-up, five minutes, arm circles, light jogging or dynamic stretching, then three sets of push-ups. That's interesting, light jogging. Uh, three sets of push-ups at 50 to 70% of your baseline, then rest one to two minutes between sets, sets. And then Saturday is rest or active recovery like I mean, I do this on the weekends anyway, just, just I'll end up being walking. Okay, so week two, we're gonna add one to two push-ups to each set compared to last week. This sounds easy. This sounds like I can absolutely do this. If last week you did seven push-ups per set, this week aim for eight to nine. So then it's giving me my schedule. Then week three, it's saying add another one to two push-ups for each set. So for the next four weeks, this is all I'm gonna do. And make sure you're maintaining proper form. Huh, uh, okay, I'm just gonna follow the plan. Uh, apparently I'm going to be doing a hundred pushups by Christmas. We'll see if this actually works. So follow along if you want to see what happens. And once you complete week four, we'll adjust the plan for the next phase based on your progress. Okay. So I'm going to do my under my, or my, my max pushups. Now I haven't really stretched or anything. So I'll do a little stretching. Maybe I'll do that on camera and then we'll do the pushups. Uh, whatever I can do for max push-ups, I'm guessing it's somewhere around 30 right now. It might be more than that, but um, we'll see how many I can do. And then I'll put that in here and have it help me figure out what my first week is going to look like from that. So, all right, so let's do some light arm circles here as recommended by ChatGPT. All right, just nice arm workout, whatever. I feel like I should just get down and do the push-ups because that would be more interesting for the video. So maybe we'll edit this part out. I really don't know. But um, the last time I did this in 2015 with a challenge like this, somebody said, oh, you should take before and after pictures with your shirt off person. But okay, so this is my person beforehand. This is what I look like before being able to do 100 push-ups, doing whatever number of push-ups I'm going to do now. So gratuitous shirt off shot. Uh, I guess that makes it more interesting. So that's what I look like. All right, great. Uh, okay, we're gonna do the push-ups now. See how this goes. All right, just done some really basic stretching. See how many push-ups we can do. Here we go. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, oh, oh, oh. 41, 41. Uh, I definitely broke form on the last couple there. If I even had good form throughout, I'll let you be the judge of that. But now we've got 41 or 42. So, okay. Come on, camera. Thought of me. Over here. 42. So now I'm going to go into ChatGPT and say I just did 42. Today is day one. I just did 42 push-ups. I'll just say 41. I'll just say 40. I just did 40 push-ups as my max. Please tell me specifically this month's plan. All right. Been a while since I maxed out push-ups, so that was interesting. Ah, great work on hitting 40 push-ups. Now that we have your baseline, here's the detailed plan for the rest of September based on your max. So, uh, Thursday, warm up five minutes, blah, blah, blah. Uh, oh, it's telling me today I should do three sets 
<laughs> okay, fine. I just did 40, okay. Three sets of 20 to 28 push-ups today, resting one to two minutes between sets, so I'll do that still today. Then Saturday is gonna be my next day, Sunday is whatever. And then next week I'm doing, I'll probably do Monday. I'll probably uh, alter this so that it's Monday, Wednesday, Friday instead of Thursday, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, because those are just easier days for me. Um, but yeah, it's given me a specific plan. This is what I will be doing for the next four weeks, so. I'll probably do like a weekly check-in and just say where things are for the week. Today's day one. That was, yeah, I'll probably just do it tomorrow where I do three sets of 20 to 28 on Friday. And then we'll start from there starting next week on Monday. So see how this goes. See if ChatGPT can help me get to 100 push-ups. All right. Thank you very much. Come along if you want to follow along and see how this goes as well as all the other things that are happening on this YouTube channel. I don't even know what I'm gonna do with this channel, but I've had it for 18 years and it's time to use it. So that's that's what's happening right now. All right, thank you. There you go, that is the end of this video. You can check out some of these other videos, or if you want, you can go check out our new community as of this video. It's a brand new community, the communal individual. Otherwise, check out one of these other videos. I hope you enjoy a fantastic day. Thanks so much for watching.